Um, yeah, so we had some power issues at our house last week. It was the uh, regional natural gas outage, and then it was a it went from the that wide that large scale down to a very localized yeah. power issue in my apartment, my, me and my where me and my family live together. Yeah. Um, we turn stuff on. We plug stuff in there all the time, too. You guys yeah. are yeah. constant, and, and you won't shut up about it. Right. We have electricity. Yeah, we, we have yeah. electricity. <laughs> it works yeah. most of the time. We, I mean, I have it, too, but I don't talk about it all the no, time. Gives, right. Gives well, bragging. I mean, it's just yeah. because you're a more interesting person than I am. You <laughs> so know, you don't have to scrape the butt, like the very, <laughs> it's like know. scraping out the bottom yeah. of the barrel <laughs> to get... <laughs> You know, yeah, yeah, really reducing the integrity of the barrel, yeah. right? Just to get something to say, yeah. Just yep. to <laughs> Gable walk into a, a little, a little circle of guys talking, and it'll be like, "My water's working." <laughs> you guys, hey, hey guys, plugged in, uh, plugged in a hot plate works. works. Yeah, I guess you could say my thing is that all my utilities are functional. <laughs> That's kind of my whole vibe. <laughs> That's not bad. Yeah, I mean, you know, I could do a lot worse. There's parts of the world where yeah. that is, but right. yeah, yeah. But but what what sucks is when your right. identity is like compromised. It would yeah. be, an, I would be in a, even more of a crisis than I am or was because it, it it has been resolved at least temporarily, it seems. But so the power has been restored. But it was frustrating because uh, we live in an apartment and we had to after the power went out it looked like it was a tripped breaker but we live in an ancient apartment that has um like fuses you know like edison style screw bulb mm, yeah. yeah fuses and um and so i checked all those and they looked okay and i couldn't figure out what else was going on so we went the weekend without power because they couldn't get an electrician out they had sent out their maintenance guys on friday this is this is st- st- no, headed just, somewhere, I no, think. Good. You're doing um, great. Thank you. And we love it. They came in and looked at stuff very um uh you know, there there was just an air of incompetence <laughs> about the whole thing. What was the first thing that tipped you off? Um when they started to remove fuses just by hand without turning off the power <laughs> okay. to the rest, you know, like the main, basically, right. without taking any of the proper precautions, Were wearing like, a rubber glove. Oh, my, or, that's spicy. That's yeah, a spicy. exactly. <laughs> and I was like, well, this is not how I would have handled <laughs> this, but you guys are the maintenance guys, so you must have some idea of what's going on. But anyway, they couldn't figure it out. The electrician that came over today couldn't figure it out. But then my wife is talking to one of our, uh, th- one of the other residents in the apartment building, and this person said, "Oh, well, did you check the breaker boxes in the hallway upstairs? So mm. this isn't a part of the a building that we've never been to because we don't live upstairs. Not allowed up there. I mean, we just have no business no. up there. We're we're not going to be hanging out in the on the landing in the just apartment building. Just go see building. what's above you, though." Yeah, does somebody yeah, I mean, live up there? Yeah, there are three three individuals that live up there, uh-huh. and um, yeah. So I mean, yeah. we just had no reason to go up there. Really? So uh, yeah, why are you guys pushing me on <laughs> this? I, I don't know. Why don't you? Why don't you? I just want to go see what's above me. I you mean, know? in my house, like in uh, like I live in a house. Oh yeah, yeah. and yeah. I go in every part of it. <laughs> right, right, <laughs> right. But right. you own every part of your house. Yeah. Do yeah. you and do you own? But so I you only, only rent own one your, your apartment. <laughs> I don't. Yeah, even but own it's that. public area. You can go and hang you out. Can just, just go. You just go sit in front true. of somebody's door. Yeah. That is true. But I'll tell you what. When just you take guys, full advantage of what you're. What you got there? If you guys come over and see the landing, you'd be like, "Oh, well, I'd see why you <laughs> have no interest in coming but up here or hanging out." But you didn't even see it before you decided not to do no, it. No, but I saw the it. stairs leading to the oh. landing, and that was enough of a tip off. They're that, creepy stairs. Yeah, they're creaky. What do they look like? Um, or what do they sound like? I mean, kind of like a you know your standard stompy, stompy yeah. step, stompy yeah. step sort of thing. Okay. There's sometimes dogs on there. Ghosts? Goes clickety clack. Huh? Got any ghosts? No ghosts as far as I know, although apparently Ernest Hemingway did stay in this wow. house at one point when okay. it was a boarding house for for the university in town. Wow. So, you know, 
I thought maybe any place he stayed, there might be a ghost there. Well, that's oh. what I was thinking. I actually was joking <laughs> early on that. <laughs> well, that I was going to say that what if what if Ernest Hemingway's ghost appears to us after we moved in, and just appears, um, you know, like moments uh, before he killed himself, right? And he's and he. Shows up and he says hi, and then he just puts a shotgun in his mouth and pulls the trigger. I thought that that would be that, that would be funny. Goes to they just do yeah. right. Maybe maybe his does. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, his goes to <laughs> like a different maybe, track. And if it's like only in Idaho, like we're we're hundreds of miles away from uh, away from where he killed himself in yeah. Idaho, but yeah. right. still same state. Yeah. Yep. You know, same state, the ghost and everything. Yeah, yeah, right. they're very concerned about the state, <laughs> state lines and borders. Um, so, so anyway, my he, neighbor the says, "The ghost says, want to see how I became a dead body? <laughs> 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 want to see how I got here?" Yeah. <laughs> my neighbor said, "Did you check the breaker boxes upstairs?" And we weren't aware of them. And then, sure enough, I go up and check the breaker box and. There's a breaker that's tripped. Flip it over, and it turned back and on. You're back up and running. And Your identity is fully assembled again. Yeah, exactly. I can claim to be a a man that lives in a place that the f- utilities all are. S- yep. You better believe we found out about it very quickly. Gabe sent a text out. <laughs> yeah. To all of his brothers. Yeah. Like, yeah. Just plugged in a electric kettle. Yes. Water is about. To be boiling. It's at one. No. It's at one sixty eight, and then another one falling a moment later. It's at one sixty nine. Yeah, one seventy. Yep. So yeah, but you guys were like, you guys were freezing. Yeah, right? over the you, weekend you it no was it, it was very cold. Um, it was very cold in the house. We, uh, yeah, we went the whole weekend without heat because um, the the maintenance guys that supposedly take care of this property didn't know where the other breaker didn't know that there the, were other breakers. that this boxes. was an issue that they needed yeah. to check yeah. right and again they're they, just they're just unscrewing yeah. fuses yeah <laughs> i don't know yeah, yeah. i don't know hey, be careful it's, yeah. or else you're gonna have another ghost that's like mm. yeah you want to see how i do right you see how yeah. I no just, actually i already I saw it, just saw <laughs> it <laughs> yeah. Dude. yeah instant replay <laughs> <laughs> yeah so um yeah, I mean that was like huge. You know, that was just enormous, big news for the weekend, and I wow. thought I should s- spend about seven minutes going over that whole. No, it's great. That whole uh, ordeal for you know a pretty excellent payoff, I'd yeah. say. Did um, so. How did your How did your daughter? Was she curious about why she was sleeping in a freezing cold house? No, she actually was completely unaffected yeah. by it because she opts to sleep on top of covers uh-huh. mm. no matter what yeah. basically um so that involves when she eventually climbs into bed with my wife and I and she's between us and she's she uh tries to just kick the covers down and it's like I don't if you don't want to sleep right. with covers that's one thing but you not sleeping with covers between us yeah. means that I don't have covers on me she and can't it's just cold. sit in like a little little like hammock of covers no she the two of you no she wants them to be like down and off of uh, her it's it's a whole yeah. you know behavioral issue that we've been praying about a lot sure, so sure. um you know we'll, we'll see if god is merciful to us in that in that way yeah it might just be a trial you know god doesn't give you more than you can handle so maybe i can handle just being a little chilly in the morning this week on advanced answering techniques protecting yourself from your children <laughs> Answering Techniques. Hello, everybody. I'm your host, Josh. This is Advanced Answering Techniques, the podcast where we teach you how to answer questions using these advanced answering techniques. I'm joined by Caleb. Hi. And Gabe. Hi. Guys, we've got a lot of lot to get to today. Should we just crack right into the let's crack right the question? Into it. Yeah, it's a bit of a complicated. Like I said protecting yourself from your from your children as the way in. Uh-huh. Yeah, there because it was co- common right yeah. between the question that we have today and your situation, Gabe. But um, but really, uh, I'm just gonna have to let our um, contributor mm-hmm. explain what the situation is. Hi. 
I don't know why I didn't think to ask you um, all this this question before. Um, I've been kind of feeling attacked by my a couple of my kids that um, like from the moment I wake up to when I go to bed with rapid fire questions that aren't single answered. Like you can't answer them in with one thing. Do you have to think about it more? And they're, um, they're, and I could give the wrong answer. Like I, they could ask me like, a, um, if you could be a mutant animal mom, what kind of mutant animal would you be? And I think about it, I tell them and they're unimpressed and they go, well, you know what? You could be this. And so I don't know why I even bothered. And then, um, I need help. Like, how do I protect myself from having to answer these questions from, from them? It's a it's a wow. it's a tricky situation. Yeah, it is. Um, I do like that that Joy confronts the, uh, the the question. I think we all as parents deal with, which is, why do I bother? Right. <laughs> why did I even bother? Why with did that? I bother doing this? Yeah. And I do <clears throat> I do like things that I can answer with one thing. Mm-hmm. Yes. You know, and my usual thing to ans- I answer with, gun. Gun. <laughs> If you could show a a gun, oh, Oh, oh. a gun. Oh, I'm sorry, I thought you said done, but I should have guessed that it was gun because you do (laughs) usually say gun. If I'm gonna answer someone, you know, ask a question, that's what I found, honestly. With your children, show a gun. Oh, you show a I'm sorry, I'm I'm sorry. This is a you don't say gun. This is a behavior, this is a behavior that I should have noticed. (laughs) Well, because he doesn't Frequently, just use it. if I don't it. feel like answering the question and I want to answer with one yeah. thing, right? I just show my gun. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. yeah I've got a, uh, I've got sidearm. I've got fifteen different answers for that. Yeah. or whatever. Like a clip a normally clip, has, you know, like yeah. rounds wise. That's a pretty big. It's a big. Is that? Clip. Is it? It's what like is it? Like twelve? Yeah, it's like twelve. Or, yeah, yeah. Man, I'm not really a gun like, guy. If it's a handgun. Yeah. Yeah. Um I'm not I'm not really a gunman. <laughs> You're not a he's not a gunman. That's no. good. Yeah. That's no. that's a, typically But you good. push me. You push me. You'll see what yeah. you yeah. see what happens. You'll watch him. He'll Gabe's become, answer to some yeah. questions eventually is a gun. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's not quite as fast as mm-hmm. as yours. He's a little slower right. on the draw. Yeah. And I would say uh, Hemingway's answer to uh one big sure. question was gun. Was gun. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yep. <laughs> he, um, <laughs> he stuck that answer right in his mouth, didn't he? <laughs> it's, the it kinda, in. it's the kind of answer yeah. you swallow. <laughs> 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 if you're quick, if you're quick enough, you might. But I don't think he was. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. That really went sideways for him. <laughs> you yeah. swallow really hard. Sideways, <laughs> really fast. downwards, upwards, all mm-hmm. every which way. Yep. yep. I think so. Um, yeah, we love Hemingway here, Papa. Um, mm-hmm. But he killed himself, and mm-hmm. you know, and that's, that's what we don't want right. Joy to do. Right. right. Yeah. I'm not saying that's <laughs> the answer here. I'm no, just saying no, no. That's well. I'm going to use one thing to answer a question. Put everyone to silence. Yeah. Right. Just show a gun. Yep. Um, but uh, but but here in this situation, it it does. Joy does seem desperate. She yeah. does seem like she's being pushed yeah. to extremity. Yeah, you yeah. can hear it in by her, her voice. Children. She's, yeah, she's kind of quavering. She seems, she seems yeah. upset. <laughs> Which I will say now uh, does give me. It does make me feel a little guilty because we got we got this question a couple weeks ago. So yeah. it's been sitting uh, for yes. for a couple yeah. weeks. So let's let's give her an answer. Okay? Yeah, let's do it. You know, like 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 Joy is like her children to her to us. Right. right. She's always asking questions. <laughs> yeah. It's true. <laughs> right. And yeah, and yeah. they're usually not answered with one thing. <laughs> they and usually... My strategy doesn't work. <laughs> no. Yeah, it's a since it's not a visual medium. Yeah. yeah. No, I, could, well, I guess Caleb, I could take a video he, of me showing a gun and you just do. send it. I mean, to her. I like I again, <laughs> I I did a I did a bad job kind of dealing with your with your thing cuz you do often <laughs> Right. When you first hear a question, just open up, yeah. just kind of pull your shirt back and and just display a, a, a firearm. Yep. It's a revolver. Um, yeah. 
And uh, and but forty four um, Magnum. Yeah, but I uh, a, a forty four Magnum revolver. Wow, a dirty dirty Harry. Dirty Harry style gun. Yeah. So no clip. Yeah. Yeah, there's no clip in this. No, this is. This has got shooter. a maximum of six answers. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Um, well, yeah, it's a beautiful, <laughs> it's a beautiful weapon. It's a beautiful <laughs> weapon. <laughs> it's a beautiful that, weapon and a beautiful answer. Sometimes <laughs> we love it. We love yep. your. We love your gun. <laughs> but back to joy. <laughs> uh, when we're thinking about sort of how to how she should how to advise her mm-hmm. on this issue, there's we can empathize, right? Mm. Children do ask these kinds of questions yep. constantly. Yes. Yes. They're my, my children are asking questions mm-hmm. all day long. Yep. Yeah. You know. My my kid asks me to uh she'll climb into a very small space like a cupboard under, mm-hmm. you know, in the under the kitchen counter. Yeah. or something. And then she'll say, "Dada, come on in." Yeah. And she'll invite me in. Yeah. And then I'll say, "I I can't. I can't go there." And she'll ask me why. Yeah, and then I say, well, "I'm too big." Yeah, I'm sure. And that is not a satisfactory answer no. to her. Yeah, so she wants you to be close. These That's kids nice. have questions. I mean, it's great. It's well, you know, but, she wants me to be involved. That's but, awesome. But it it is also one of those things where yep. children are often attacking you with their questions. Uh-huh. I think she's trying to yeah. point out that yes. look, you're too big. Right. Look what I can right. do, and you can't, yeah. Dad. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah. she's not subtle with those yeah. with those sorts of hints at all about yeah. my. My, um, you know, insane weight issue. Right. right. Um, so it's, you know, she's ruthless. Yeah. And, she's putting and on that's, pants. And, I think that's yeah. good because I'm trying to, you know, raise a, a strong female character. Right. Sure. <laughs> a yeah. real character. Yeah. A real character. That's good. Yeah. 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 I like that. My son asked me a, a good question, kind of drove me insane mm-hmm. for a moment. Watching Jurassic Park. That's the sign of a good question. <laughs> yeah. One that yeah. will drive you to madness. Yeah, yeah. Quickly. Yeah. Uh, we're watching Jurassic Park, and he turns to me at one point and goes, Dad, do hobbits drive cars? <laughs> 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 and I think we all know the answer is no, they're too short. Right. Well, yeah. yeah I mean, I just I had no idea what to say. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I just laughed in his face. <laughs> Can't reach the pedal. <laughs> too, too. Well, yeah. I uh, thought for sure it would be something about Jurassic Park. <laughs> <laughs> was he, yeah, was he maybe watching them speed away from a right. dinosaur and thinking, right. well, the hobbits could have made... Hobbits could have used that used to get the if, ring to Mordor. If yeah. hobbits can drive, they'll be fine when dinosaurs attack. <laughs> yeah. I, there was some kind of yeah. loose connection yeah. to what was yeah. happening on screen. Right. But, uh, yeah. So, yeah, that one made me go insane for a little bit. Yeah. And distracted me from what was happening on screen. Yeah, it's pushing you to the utter limits, to your utter limits. To yes, mm-hmm. just what you can deal with. Yes, yeah. with these, with these. Kind of like what dairy farms do for dairy cows. Right. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. They're go ahead. Go ahead. Pushes uh, them to their utter limit. Utter right. limits. Get the I most see. milk. Utter yeah. limits. <laughs> yeah. No, I was. That was not. That's on me. <laughs> that's definitely on you, Josh. <laughs> <laughs> That's on me. I was, yeah, I was, yeah. What, what is that? Like four? There's like four on another. Four on another. Four on. A- We're not going to say what. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. So that's so. Yeah, children are a problem, and they're <laughs> and they're mean. Yep. And um, but you can protect yourself. Mm-hmm. You can. It's possible. Um, one of the big things Joy said specifically. That um, that they're criticizing her choice of what she would be if she was a mutant animal, mm-hmm. right? Um, one thing you could do is just is just have better answers for that. Like, yep. spend a little time. Yeah, yeah. That's that's that that seems like a pretty straightforward one to kind of you know imagine. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What you know? What the, the, these kids? They're going to be asking something in the realm of, you know, mutant animal, yeah. mutant animal, or other. And don't be honest. Yeah, this is my uh, p- my right. opinion on it. Is oh. if you want to be get through this quickly, don't yeah. be honest. Think yeah. of what they want. Yeah, mm. and give it to them. Yeah. Okay. So don't talk. Don't try to con- be sincere. Right. Yeah. Play the game yeah. to get through it quickly. It's yeah. not parenting. It's <clears throat> pandering. 
Right. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Yes. It's. I think that's really good. Is lie. Is yes. Don't be honest with your children. Mm. Establish a relationship early on. Right. That's you understanding what they want and giving it to them right away. Yes. And I mean, yeah. this is this does kind of connect to what I I was thinking when I when I right. heard this was, well, you know, the best protection that you can have is if they just if they just don't even come to you right. with the question. Right. Good point. So just establish yourself right. through your behavior and your interactions mm-hmm. with them as somebody that they don't want anything to do with. <laughs> hey, you you, know, you they don't, don't have time for these questions. Right, yeah. Or, I mean, yeah, it could be a time thing. It could just yeah. even be the response, the the manner of the response that you're giving them. Yeah. Um, if it's like... Yelling. Yeah. Y- screaming. Yeah. Well, I mean, I'm not... Intelligible. And I'm not advocating for any sort of abuse, obviously. No, no, right. no. But not just, overt. N- well, you're not <laughs> yelling. And you're not yelling at them. I'm just saying, just yes. yelling. Yeah, or right. Screaming. Exactly. You know? Well, yeah. we definitely can't ask mom because uh, she's she's just going to absolutely gibberish. lose her mind. Yeah. Complete gibberish. Yeah. yeah. So let's let's play that out. Um, let's play that out. Okay. So, yeah. uh, ask me a question. Okay. Uh, uh um, what's your favorite color? It's pretty good. It's a pretty yeah. good. I mean, I don't want Caleb to say <laughs> no. anything else. Right? Exactly. I, yeah. That, Something that's like pretty that. Convincing. Taz main. Do you Taz the answer? It does kind of have a Taz. Just yeah. Taz answer. the answer. What's your favorite dude. color? Taz. Yeah. What's your favorite? Oh, color? oh, I see. I see what you're saying. Taz yeah, the. You answer. just Taz the yeah, answer. Taz it. Yeah. Um, it's yeah. an old technique. It's an oldie bit of goodie. Yeah, and I combine that with my other technique. That we were going to shut up. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. They yeah. Ask yeah. A question. <laughs> you're showing <laughs> them. Yeah. You're showing the them a gun. Handle going, of the <laughs> dirty, hairy yeah. handgun. <laughs> yeah. There's um uh our Jewish listeners will <laughs> uh, be familiar with the technique. It's an old r- rabbinical technique okay. of answering a question with a question. Yeah, that's good too. That's um good. and uh and so yeah that's that, just reflect just you know yeah I'm yeah. not it, like in the in the, in a situation with a child what do you guys think is a good is a good go to question to answer a question with I guess um I think I I one I like to use is um have you cleaned your room that's good perfect mm-hmm. immediate yeah yeah. Yeah, and maybe you get something done out of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you know, yeah. Uh, or um, have you cleaned my room? Yeah. Right. Have we cleaned my room? Yeah. I like to say it that way. <laughs> <laughs> have we cleaned my room? <laughs> What's your favorite? What what kind of mutant animal would you be? Have we cleaned, cleaned my, my room? room? <laughs> yep. And um, they and if every yeah. time maybe that's something you do is it's like an answer tax. Yeah. Right. It's like if I'm going to answer this, you got to do a chore. Right. Yeah. You get yeah. something out of it. Yeah, I was thinking of you could do like a like a big kind of like a schedule for when you can ask questions. Okay, mm-hmm. so it starts off no questions in the morning, right. Right. zero questions. Yeah. Between not until I've had, had my up, coffee. Mm-hmm. After you have mm-hmm. coffee, yeah, then you can answer yes or no questions. Yeah. Right. Yeah, and then after that, we can get into more lengthy. Yeah. Yep. Answers. <laughs> there, there will be a Q&A at the end of the day. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Save all your questions and applause for that time. <laughs> right, right. Yeah. We don't want to clutter up this <laughs> right. all day. Yeah. It's gonna, everything's going to go know, a lot I love faster. It. It's insane how often my kids do applaud me yeah. Yeah, at home. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's wild. And it no. takes up a lot of time. Mm-hmm. And to be respectful, you know, you have to... Yeah. Bow and thank mm-hmm. you, thank you, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. My 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 daughter does encourage and and yeah, give she gives positive feedback on simple tasks that I'm doing. I was setting up the stroller. Mm-hmm. It was folded up, so I was unfolding it, and she saw me do it in one swift motion, and she said, "Good job, Dad." <laughs> <laughs> and I felt so condescended. <laughs> <laughs> what does she think of me that I'm like this incompetent idiot walking around and then I like do one thing <laughs> smoothly and well and she's like whoa like, dad's having a good day yeah. I need to positively reinforce mm. this we we need to see more of this throughout the week dad wow. that sort of thing so yeah you're so more does competent happen. than your uh, maintenance guys not hard they couldn't do that not hard no. to be anyway um 
Yeah. So I guess those maintenance guys would be tinkering with that stroller. Yeah, for their a while. kids, their kids would probably be like, try, try hard, do better. Yeah. Dead. Those guys are so distracted by all the questions their kids are asking. Yeah. Well, I was asking them all sorts of questions. That I too. was like, "What was kind of fit, what kind of mutant animal would you be?" <laughs> yeah. While they're trying to like mess with the rece- the the outlets and everything. Don't you need gloves for that? No, no, no. Yeah. No, no, no. Oh, no shoot, no, no. I do, but I can't yeah. go back yeah. now. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Lesson that you got to learn as a parent. Um, but if I was going to be a mutant animal, I think I would be a chimp and a gorilla. Mm, a chimp and a gorilla. Yeah. That's. Can you can you describe that a little more? I mean, it just kind of looks like an ape. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. So something that's a blend between <laughs> yeah, a chimp just... and a. Dr- okay, I thought maybe it <laughs> no. was somehow like it was a master blaster situation. <laughs> yeah. With, but the yeah. but they were the same <laughs> yeah. biological entity. His legs that's not a bad are idea just though. Fused yeah. to the gorilla's yeah. neck because because yeah. chimps they already have like four hands basically. Basically, right. so. You know, at that point, you're you're rocking six hands right. with and a so chimp on a gorilla's shoulders, but they're like <laughs> they're like the spine just is just shared. It goes <laughs> yeah, up girl. all just the way. Like, there's like just, there's like floors on an elevator for heads. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. <laughs> yes, you know <laughs> the way your body has an elevator. <laughs> if your spine is is an elevator, okay. <laughs> <laughs> the heads that come Sorry. off of it are yeah. four. A <laughs> lift for those across the <laughs> yeah. pond. Yeah, yeah, that's right. <laughs> for our British listeners. It's just um, increasingly smaller apes as it right. goes up. Mm-hmm. Right. <laughs> yeah, and I have I have always thought of my head as just a single floor. <laughs> just, <laughs> it's just another It's an elevator stop. for food. <laughs> another it just stop goes down. on True. the skyscraper that is my body. Yep, yep, yep. It's um, the penthouse. It's the penthouse <laughs> sweet. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's my brain. <laughs> yep. 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 It's uh, mine is quite spacious. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Mm-hmm. Yes. Fully furnished. Have you put <laughs> things in there? What's that? Have you put anything in there? Is no, I'm there just like saying it's empty? expansive. Oh, mm-hmm. I see. Yeah. I see. Yeah. Open, uh, open empty concept. Though. Yeah. yeah. Very Not open. much in there. Very open minded. Yeah. Okay. That's good. Okay. That's good. Yeah. Um, the uh, Caleb, uh, what mutant animal would you be? I, th- oh, I thought boy. I thought we might help Joy by yes. yeah. providing so Can so you know a yep. a chimp and a gorilla. That's good. Mm-hmm. That is good. Yeah. That is good. Um, two similar things. Um, okay, what if I was a, a flamingo and a donkey? A flamingo and a donkey. Okay, so you're and this a is blend. the way they're mutants. It's just that yeah. they're combined animals because we also have well, teenage the, mutant ninja turtles who are right. just no. Kind I don't of think humanized. I, mean, I, don't, I wasn't saying that it had to be what Gabe what Gabe did. Okay. Yeah. Th- I mean, that's that's kind of just a hybrid. Yeah, yeah. It's like a chimera. Yeah. yeah. So I that's how I interpreted the question, yeah. and I mean that's part of the problem with the question right. is there are so many different ways. Yeah. To there's take ways it. different yeah. ways to be. And mutants. I could see a child being like, no, no, no. I'm and not talking Caleb, about chimeras. I'm talking right. about mutants. Absolutely. And right. Caleb, while you're thinking. Gabe, what do you think it is about a chimp and a gorilla sort of combined yeah. in some way that is that makes this an especially good answer that will shut down Joy's children? I mean, in my experience, children just love monkeys. That's true. And they don't even know that chimps and gorillas aren't monkeys a right. lot of times. When you you t- kind of have to teach them that. So yeah. if you just start talking about monkeys, yeah. generally... You know, yeah. it, the the conversation turns to Curious George, right. and you can say, "Just go read a Curious George book in your room." Or That's something. right. Yep. You can. It's a deflection mm. uh, that you can you can just kind of divert them into that uh, that other activity. Go away. I I love you. You know, you yeah. make me so proud. I'm so happy you're part of my life. But please, just don't bother me. Just go you away. Just <laughs> like, I got my new animal. Thing. Okay. It's um goldfish. Mm-hmm. That's mutated with cocaine. <laughs> okay. Like the snack cracker? <laughs> no, no, no. Oh. Like an actual fish. Okay. A fish. And it gets it gets there there's cocaine and then the green ooze. Okay. And then the goldfish is there. So we can snort okay. the goldfish. Uh yeah, it's it's crazy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it so, takes on yeah. cocaine like <laughs> Oh, properties, I see. and that's I see. what you would be. And the gold and the cocaine takes on goldfish like yeah. properties. Then they're the, and then they're one thing. Okay, so the cocaine can breathe underwater. Okay, good. Finally, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
<laughs> so and the goldfish <laughs> is like um really good at finance it sobers you up <laughs> oh yeah okay. yeah 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 <laughs> yeah the goldfish can keep you from getting too drunk gotcha. that you have to go to sleep so right. you have to you stay awake and be drunk okay <laughs> you'll find this out when you eat this particular goldfish <laughs> i get yeah <laughs> and that's you yeah you're I'm, the goldfish i'm the yeah. cocaine you're the cocaine goldfish, goldfish. Yeah. it's different than cocaine bear yeah, yeah. goldfish isn't high no it just has some properties right has the properties of, of yeah. cocaine. cocaine, but does it change the anatomy or the physiology of the goldfish? Yeah, at the all goldfish to be? is wearing like uh, it, it gold when it because it becomes a person. Oh, wow. oh okay. okay. <laughs> that's that's. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you you really did bury the lead on that. <laughs> You were kind of, it seemed to be leading, le- letting us sort of uh, make some pretty big swings about yeah about Wait. what this what might happen. And yeah. You seemed okay with it, but then you're like, actually, <laughs> do you mean this is the effect the, the effect of col- cocaine on a goldfish? Is yeah. it becomes a like, person? Just becomes a guy. Did you mean Tom um, Cocaine? The no, no, Northwest no. Public Radio. What I mean oh, yeah. is, you know how the turtles get with the goo, and then yes. the goo makes okay. them into basically guys. Right. Turtle guys. Oh, okay. So it's just you add the cocaine to too. Okay. So fish gives him goo, and okay. then there's cocaine there too. Yeah. So he's like a fish man. Okay. But he does have property. This is cocaine. this okay. is a busy day in the sewer. There's <laughs> yeah. toxic waste. I was just thinking about and things someone people flush down cocaine. the toilet. Yeah, you know? that's true. That's true. And yeah. he loves this guy. Loves hot dogs. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. 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 I know how you like to flush an eight pack mm-hmm. down the toilet every mm-hmm. week. Well, yeah, I mean, he did they just in case he doesn't have any brothers or sisters right. like the turtles, yeah. But he so he has to take kind of on the whole, yeah, he has to play all roles, which is perfect because that's partially how, why yeah. he, how he's cocaine. And he's wearing, and I'm 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 picturing him really clearly, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How I don't I, I just it. I do have a very firm okay. image. He looks like he's got he's definitely wearing a um he's wearing a suit. It's like a it's like a beige suit. Okay. Mm. Kind yeah. of you know uh, silken, Sli- slightly iridescent. It's perhaps slightly yeah. iridescent. It he's shines got a, depending on which way you look. Yeah. At he's it. got a t-shirt on and he's got his sleeves pushed up on his okay. on his suit yeah. jacket. Yeah, he's like a hipster right? with a suit. Yeah. And um and his his hair's you know back. It's got like a top knot. That's good. Yes, yeah. he does. And brace leather bracelets. And leather bracelets and and copious jewelry, S- sunglasses. Just in general. Yeah. And uh and he is but his but his his uh his face is a the face of a gold. <laughs> the right. face of a gold. Face of a goldfish. Yeah. He's got to wear this crazy <laughs> um. Like necklace that mm-hmm. has water in it. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. That, so he's his gills are like. Oh, okay. Kind like of like water. Uh, yeah. Like yeah. F- the guy from Hellboy. Yes. The exactly. fishman from Hellboy. Abraham. Abe. Abe. Yeah. yeah. The fishman from that. That's actually pretty good. Yeah, that is that is what I was. But thinking. he's he seems more like a peyote goldfish or something. <laughs> yeah, he's you're like right, he's you're like right. chilled he's like out an LSD. and he's like seeing beyond yeah, our yeah, reality. Right. Sort of this guy's you know this goldfish is into finance, yeah. like you were saying. He's, yeah. he's the DMT goldfish. <laughs> Abe from Abe Hellboy. is the DMT goldfish. Yeah. <laughs> this is the cocaine goldfish uses his powers to yeah come up with uh like pyramid <laughs> schemes yeah. <laughs> Josh, what's your uh, your mutant tr- yeah, animal choice? Yeah, it's just a. Uh, mine is a uh, fentanyl shark. <laughs> okay. Oh wow. yeah! No, Whoa. no, 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 no. That's Whoa! Good. No, um, I don't know. We're gonna have to come back to that. Okay. Um, we do need to get to some other kind of ways that that yes. joy can. <clears throat> you know, we. I think we're doing a good job with the mutant stuff. Mm-hmm. Yes, she's going to have a pretty yeah. deep resource here. Yeah. Um, but I do want to continue to think of other options. I for her other ways of protecting herself from her from her children's questions. I, right? I did think of one in the meantime. Yeah. I know that you haven't really shared much, Josh. If mm-hmm. you, I don't want to, you know, uh, step on your right opportunity to share yeah 
So this is your no, opportunity no, no. Oh, to, no, no. to you prevent should, Gabe, me. From you you're the host. Ahead. You're the host, but Gabe is giving you an me, opportunity, me an opportunity to, to finally have something to say. Right. Well, I was just was. Yeah. I just didn't want to keep yammering on. Unless, no, no. I want to. I'm more more than interested. So, in so yammer, yammer, yammer. You Gabe. ever been to the DMV? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Take a number. Yeah. You just have a little mm-hmm. belt. Uh, you know, a, like a a little belt. What's the word that I'm looking for? Uh, holster. Holster thing for yes. a take a number. Yeah. Your children can go up and take a number. And I know that it's not exactly pr- protection as like, you know, just yeah. a stop, you know, right. just a, a way to a barrier necessarily. But it is a way to kind of mitigate and like sort of. Um, and be fair. Yeah, right. You know, well, okay, this guy has to wait because my my other kid pulled the number mm-hmm. first. So and uh, okay, so but it could be other people too, or others. Yeah, yeah. sure. Yeah, just yeah. take a number. If you're going to ask a question, right. you have yeah. to take a number, and then when we call your number, you will be served yeah. an yep. answer to your question. Um, so that's just a way of kind of controlling the volume yes. of the of you know the flow of the questions and everything. And it really sure. is one question per per number. Mm-hmm. Like if you have multiple questions, you could rip three or four out. Wow. At it at one that time. That might be alarming, though. But honestly, yeah, I like the idea. But to to feel the tug several different times on that little holster. Yeah. Well, I'm, go, there's settings. I'm in, there, I'm set. I got a, I got a lot of answers that are going to be coming out yeah. of me soon. There's ways yeah. that you can mitigate that with the like. There's controls on the actual unit that okay. that yeah. will um, you know resist the. You won't feel the tug quite as much. That's well, that's like a personal and it's sort preference. Of, you thing, take you know? one. Mm-hmm. You take one, and then it takes a little. It, uh, you right. can mm-hmm. set the speed of how yes. long it takes for the next. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Next number to be dispensed. Yeah, the we're sound dispensing of it out. Yeah. ten numbers every hour. Okay. Or, you know, yeah. whatever that num whatever that uh, ratio is for you. you can, can you also get meat? It. You can get you can get meat out right out of there. Yeah. You can get <laughs> yeah, it's right above the number slot. There's a beef jerky and it's what you get is these these cartridges of that are just spools of beef jerky. Yeah. That like a uh, fruit by yeah. the foot, yeah. but it's beef jerky. Yeah. And and it's those only <laughs> come in um in barbecue pine uh like honolulu barbecue flavor nice it's weird and gabe did just describe this as sort of a little you know thing yeah that's on your belt (laughs) but it's much more like a backpack (laughs) and have you done that where you go to the dmv and you just you take a number and then you just ask a simple question Mm -hmm. yeah you just like go to the dmv take a number hey i've done it where i where i go up and i and I pull it out of the thing, and then I throw it in my mouth, and I say, "This beef jerky tastes terrible." <laughs> yeah. you know, expecting it to my be beef mom's jerky. beef jerky is way better. Yeah, it is that question of like maintaining a relationship with your child, having that 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 free exchange of of ideas <laughs> between you, <laughs> which is what you child. don't want. You're trying to well, limit that. I mean, it's you, not free. As a parent, you have to decide. Well, it doesn't and, cost know, money. But it is, it yes. does have boundaries, and it is fettered right. yes. pretty pretty closely by the ticker tape thing. Yeah. Yep. That's all. Well, that's, that's good. All. You could also, uh, just so you don't have to buy anything new, um, mm-hmm. you can just put earbuds in your ears yeah. and just hold up a single finger when your kids ask you a question. Mm-hmm. Say, hmm? point to your yeah. ears. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> finger up first. Sorry. And <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, listening. Excuse me. <laughs> Sorry, so, I'm listening to You Made It Weird. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Couldn't hear you over hardcore history. <laughs> Sorry, I'm listening to something I can't listen on the speakers because there's so much cursing. Yeah, yeah right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, w- I don't want your mind exposed to this filth, but I'll just pump it into my ears all day, all day. every day. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't uh, resonate with that idea at all. <laughs> no, not at all. Guys, um, I think it's time for us to sort of wrap up here. Yeah. Um, do, do you feel that we've given Joy some some adequate options for for dealing with, with these questions from her kids? I think so. Adequate, you know, mm-hmm. 
Do we have more time than adequate. to to yeah. to kind of figure out what that I mean, means? They, they what is that, be, or yeah. do we just say sure? It's good the enough. techniques <laughs> should be advanced, but right. adequate <laughs> adequate is good at points. Well, sometimes adequate is advanced. Sometimes mm-hmm. it's hard to get to adequate. That, yeah. It's true. Yeah, the only sometimes solution getting to adequate is like, mm-hmm. whoa, okay, yeah. we this is adequate. Yeah, holy yeah. holy moly, mom, that's an adequate answer. Yeah, yeah. Um, now you're you moving your, on with your life. Thank you for your utter adequacy. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Yeah, that's a different way to think about it. Yeah. Which doesn't fly in the dairy industry. No. No. They're not looking for adequacy. No, they want it. Well, that's the bare minimum. Sup- they want superior milks. Yeah. Superior milks. Yeah. They're, they're all about white supremacy. <laughs> <laughs> yep. yep. In terms in the dairy of industry. white milk yep. being super being sup- the supreme product. Yeah. What about chocolate? What if you could get yes. chocolate milk right out? Sure. Have you guys ever thought about that? I'm sure somebody has, but I haven't. <laughs> oh, like from a chocolate cow? Yeah, like a yeah. chocolate cow. You get chocolate milk out of it. Yeah. That way you just don't even have to put that chocolate in. No. It's already it's, there. Yeah, it saves you a step. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know who's lobbying against the, the breeding and, and proliferation of these brown cows? Mm. Bosco. Mm-hmm. Uh, Bosco. Or Hershey's. Oh yeah. Think about it. Follow Ovaltine. the money. Mm. Who's Ovaltine. making who's making chocolate milks out there? Nesquik. I'm Ovaltine, talking to you. Hershey's. Ovaltine. Yeah, that's true. Gabe. Yeah, they're so, really standing in the way of those mutant. We could do mutant it. chocolate cows. It's like which cool. is what I which is what I would. Be. It's like we that's could. That's great. Josh. We could have. So are you like a guy, or are you just chocolate chocolate milk cow? Um, this is yeah no I'm a I am a I'm a guy who is also a chocolate milk cow. <laughs> I'm not a guy, right? Because because you're a cow. Yeah, I'm a cow. well, you're a cow, right? Yeah. Right, but mutant, you know, yeah. teenage right. mutant ninja chocolate cow yeah. or something, yeah. or teenage mutant. Um, yeah, it almost seems too teenage, useful, right? Like most mutant, of these. Let me mutations. just say this a few more okay, times: sorry. teenage mutant. Mm-hmm. Um, Finance and yeah. goldfish. Yeah. Teenage mutant. Yeah. Um, chocolate cow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. Chocolate wow. milk cow. Yeah. Right. It's not even your birthday and we're just letting you go. Adolescent. <laughs> 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 yep. Adult Pup- mutant pubescent. pubescent cow. Chocolate milk cow. <laughs> yeah. Hey, call, somebody call Seth Rogen. I got a hot idea for a new script. Pubescent what, Josh? Oh, I was just using the word pubescent. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought it might make, make the chocolate cow even less sort of appetizing <laughs> to be pubescent. Oh, uh, wow. Okay. I mean, I listen, is, is Joy going to have more questions for us next week? Probably. You yeah. know? This isn't yeah. going to sew that whole thing up. Spoiler alert. Uh, before we <laughs> recorded this, we already have perfect a number of questions, and that's, that's great. That's, that's awesome. what we appreciate. I like the questions, reliability, we love the questions. Um, yeah, the technique I think is going to be multi pronged, and that's the yeah. the the practice of that is going to be what's key to this. Use yeah. all right. use many of these different techniques. Yeah, see which works best for your kids. Yeah. Shuts them up, leaves that's, you alone, allows mm-hmm. you to be a mother. Mm-hmm. That's just good for yes. that's just good for parenting in general. Is right. like no, like do not go for consistency in any way. No, like no, no. be completely unpredictable mm-hmm. and totally vacillate between yep. being engaged with them and their questions to where you're just, or you could just point at your headphones and say, nah, yeah. and kind of put the taz on. <laughs> <that too. laughs> yeah, exactly. That's one other way. Yeah. You reveal the gun, yeah. point to headphones. Yeah, and I think I think ultimately the result will be the same, where they they just would say, "Well, I'm not even going to bother." Yeah. yeah. What's yep. the point? So. Yep. Bother someone else with your questions, yeah. kids. Yeah. Bother someone else with your questions, indeed. Thanks so much for listening <laughs> to Advanced Answering Techniques, um, and uh, you can send in your questions, like Joy has, to. Uh, advanced answering techniques at gmail.com. Please bother us with your questions. Please do. We like the questions. Yeah. Why bother us with your questions? Because, <laughs> because we don't. You to. <laughs> because because, because <laughs> you we don't, need you there's to. no show. Yeah. <gasps> Thank you. It just ends. Thanks so much. <laughs> Hands in. Hands in. Hands in. Hands, Hands out. out. Congratulations. Congratulations.
Congratulations. That's Congratulations. Lo- I, I think we should stop doing I think we should. this. I think this Why? should be I think this should be the end of doing it. Uh, you know. Okay, so if next week if I do it, you guys I'll do it myself. Okay. You can do it yourself. <laughs> yeah, you can do it. You can do it yourself. That's fine. Okay. Uh, okay, that's gonna be good. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Kids can't.